guys, it's Tactical Gaming Network here. Um, today I'm going to be showing you how to get a server, any server, from any of the mod packs in the Feed the Beast launcher. So, the first step you're going to need to do is open up the Feed the Beast launcher, um, just like this. Um, then you want to select the server what you're actually going to want to make. So in this case, I'm just going to be doing the Monster Feed the Beast pack as an example. There's quite a few mods in it, I believe it has... 211 something like that it's probably less um, but anyway you want to press download server at the top um, that is currently not working for me I think it is just me let me know in the comments though if that doesn't work either um, you want to go to this page which is an alternative page to that link here um, so this link here will be in the description um, this is also pretty much the exact same step you just have to press download server and it will uh, download you then open it um, and then create a new folder on your desktop and call it whatever you want. I already have the stuff here. Um, uh, let me see if I still have the uh, folder in my the thing in my downloads. Um, yeah, I have it. All right. So we'll restart then because uh, I want to show you guys how to do it from scratch. So when you have this WinRAR file, in my case it will say Mod Packs Monster. Drag all the files from the WinRAR zip into your folder that you made on your desktop. Um, you don't need the WinRAR file anymore, you can just close it down. Once you've um, dragged the files in, you want to find this Windows batch file called Server Start. Um, double click it, um, and it will start to generate all of the files um, that are needed for the server to actually work. Um, and in a second, hopefully, when the Server Properties file comes up, um, which you should generate in a little bit of time um, you can then put your Hamachi IP in which is located when you go into Hamachi and right click copy IPv4 address um, and as you can see oh no it's not generated there we go uh, it's generated that you can open that with either notepad or notepad++ I'm going to be using notepad++ the link will that, for that will be in the description uh, message of the day, that's just the message that's going to basically the name of your server. I'm just going to call it um, Nathan's um, Feed the Beast. Um, server IP is going to be what I just said, the IPv4 address, copy IPv4 address, paste it in. Um, if you don't have Hamachi by the way, which is what I'm going to be using um, for this video, type in Logmein Hamachi and it's download Logmein Hamachi. Um, and it looks like this. I'm going to press continue condition, conditions of use. Sorry, take that box. Um, press the, you want to download the unmanaged version of uh, Hamachi. Um, I'm just going to reload that. Oh, yeah, sorry, it didn't generate all the stuff, um, but it will look like this. Um, you just recopy the address, server IP, yes, um, rename it to Nathan's FTB save it then you can close it um, I'm not sure if my server will load um, but you want to launch your monster feed the beast um, normally after your server pro after you've updated your server properties you would need to um, to actually restart your server I might be able to get away with just reloading it um, we'll find out in a minute so you just gotta wait for your uh, game to start up um, also you have um, things like band IPs, um, if you go in here, you can just type, um, it's got a little uh, hint here what you need to do, so uh, I guess you could just type in, this is my Minecraft name, so that's why I call myself this, um, then you do band date, you can type in that, um, it is the 28th of the 6th, 2014 today, and then you would type in band by myself, pretty stupid if I did that to be honest. Banned until 29th of the 6th, 2014, and reason, which is hacking, um, like that. I think I have to do these in between, so I'll just do that for the sake of uh, the template. And one, just there. Save that, and then I guess we'll find out whether it actually worked or not. Um, once your Minecraft's loaded up, your server should be up. Um, you want to uh, add server and put your IPv4 address, which you get by copying the address. 
Um, and if your server doesn't appear, make sure you've put it into your server properties and if uh, it doesn't appear then restart your server. You want to join the server and should load up. Um, it takes a little bit of time, it's, it normally says not responding and then it will log you in. This is what it does. Um, and welcome to my server. So to uh, you want the thing you want to do though to actually be able to join it is you, you have to create a network. So create a network, call it whatever you want, uh, and put a password onto it. Then once you've done that, your friends can then join that. So that's how they get into the server. They have to join an existing network, put in the name what you set and the password what you set, um, and then they can get into your server using. Uh, your IPv4 address, so they don't right click the top, they right click your name in here and copy IPv4 address. So thanks for watching guys, I hope this video helped, comment if you've got any questions and make sure you subscribe to my channel, it's always a big help to me, um, and you can also get regular updates and new videos coming out every day. So guys, thanks for watching, from me, have a nice day. Yeah.